welcome to the WCTR on the move and today we're going to focus on activity tourism. Wales has some of the finest natural resources uh, for adventure sports in the UK and coupled with that it's got extremely easy access from major urban markets in England. So Professor Pritchard, exactly how important is adventure sports tourism to Wales? Oh, it's extremely important. It accounts for 1.25 million trips per year, which actually translates to about 13% of total domestic tourism to Wales. It's very important in terms of the corporate market, in terms of group market, and also very much for youth travel. What particular market segments within adventure tourism are the most important, would you say? Well, you've obviously got climbing, you've got water sports, you've got riding. Um, interestingly, Wales accounts for f over 50% of the UK's caving market. You know, so you've got the broad spectrum of um, popular sports, and then you've also got the more niche sports. And which particular destinations within Wales would you say are the most important? Well, Wales is incredibly blessed with uh, activity and adventure destinations. You've got the massive coastline, which of course now people are able to walk the whole length of the, of the Welsh coastline. You've got um, places like Anglesey, which is fantastic for water sports. You, uh, you've got uh, riding and you've got places like Snowdonia, which are fantastic for climbing, which have the National Climbing Centre. And you've also got the Gower, which is fantastic for surfing. And, you know, so literally Wales is an activity oyster. <laughs> so it's a natural playground, really. Well, thank, it is for, a thank you very playground. much, Professor Pritchard. That gives us a great insight and an overview of the market.